Hi Libra! Welcome to my channel. We're doing your June 1 to 7. This is your weeklies. We have our bi-weeklies, monthlies, um, mid-weeklies, mid-monthlies, all the... <laughs> no, basically, you know, if you're new to the channel, welcome, okay? And if you're an old fart, move along. When I say old fart, remember, those are the people who's like, who already has seen me, has watched me so many times, okay? You're part of the group. Okay, so go proceed to the reading. You know who you are. You've been with me for two, three, four years. Like, no, no, three years or two years, I think. Okay, so that you don't waste your time. Um, you have June one to seven for the new people. It's a weekly reading. We have um, we are going to be using the cartomancy. We're going to be using the bougie deck, which is my very first tarot deck. Okay, it's right here. And then once I talk about the astrology part, it's going to be based on Vedic sidereal astrology. So here we go. Uh -huh. Here we go, Libra. Let's see what's going on. Cartomancy first. Uh -huh. Let's have some coffee. Good morning. Mm -hmm -hmm. Mm. Cartomancy. Just the vibe. Um, how to say this. We'll just see how it goes. What's the energy that you're picking up for this week? Okay, here we go. I can I read it traditional, sometimes I don't. Okay. So here we go. Got a four of clubs, that's a four of wands, Libra. Oh, got a flipper. Okay, the hermit card. Okay. And ten of spades. Okay. You're saying here for others is a break uh, you guys will break up, okay. I'm not the bear of the bad news, but this is about, um, we have to end this relationship. Others, though, the end of the relationship starts a new relationship. So, I'm just saying that you are one of those who jumps one relationship to other. Okay, but it's right here. Okay. Because, I mean, if it's not a relationship ending, definitely something. It can be anything in your life that's about to end. But it all boils down to being in a relationship. So, you understand? Um, so whatever it is, it can be like you're ending your work, you're ending, but you just, it's, it's something that is transformative that you have to end, and then you wind up in a relationship. That's the, it's like a silver lining. Okay. Um, you could be, well, I have to quit my job because I have to be with this person now. There you go. That's an ending, right? Well, I can't be with my family anymore. Okay. Because I have to choose this person. You know, Sammy, there's a big divide, a big decision that you will have to make that rarely people will make. Okay, in order to be in a partnership. So this is this is this is life changing event. Mm -hmm. Life changing. Mm. Now this is also about ending of a like you can be a spiritual person and you believe in a certain uh, um, following, meaning you know it's like an established belief, like a religion. And you're gonna change religion, like okay, from one religion to the other. Um, a change of belief. Also, he's here. Um, you might want to change also an apartment. Okay? And um, you're you're looking at it like okay, well, my lease is over, and time to start a new life, you know, somewhere else. Um, this is about also moving in a different state, uh, relocating. I'm seeing here, and um, chances are you have seen, uh, you know, like I I see myself somewhere else now. This is this, uh, energy, okay? So, that's, it's, it's good, it's good, okay? You don't focus yourself on the ending. It's, uh, you know, it's like, I feel it's good. Uh, let me see here now. Okay, what's going on with your tarot? Now, the tarot comes in, uh, in the diamond edition, which you can learn class with me. Okay, if you don't know how to read tarot, I have it pre-recorded and you can join me. And then... We also have a gold edition, which, so you can already, like, if you just know the tarot already, and this is going to be a good addition to your collection. So check those out. Here we go. Let's see here. Bougie. Here we go. Ooh. We got an ace of coins. I told you. Something good is coming. An opportunity. Okay. Starting all over again. Okay. Um, I feel here, um, you... You're getting a, like if it's job, you're going to get another offer. Um, you may have a job right now and someone's going to offer you. So it's like, hey, you know, we have this opening. Would you consider? 
um, if it's about the coins. Now, I'm seeing here also, right, uh -huh. you see, um, you're lifting up your hair over here. This is for me, it's just like, I feel like karmically, whoever you're dealing with, you're, you're constantly manifesting, I feel here. Because you're, um, you know, I feel like slowly revealing yourself to this person, who you really are. Okay, Libra. Let me see. Let's see here. Hmm. Oh, page of coins. Okay. So I was getting an offer. I feel like it's this side over here. Ace of coins with the page of coins over here. Look at that one. Now the pages are material. Okay. So someone can be giving you a gift. Uh, you're giving a gift, receiving a gift, but this is about also an opportunity um, to apologize for a mistake. Because right? the page of coins with the ace of coins, like you're gonna hand them something. It's like listen, okay, and then the other person like I'm sorry. All right? So this is how it is. It's very mellow, okay. It's very mellow between the two of you. you got an eight of cups. Okay. Now remember how it told like you would have to walk from away from something to come to something. This is that. Eight of Cups, of course, is walking away, but here, um, in this deck, it's about all your chakras not being satisfied, you know, disaligned, you know, chakras will not get satisfied, but it's disaligned. So now, okay, you want to center yourself again, and I feel like centering yourself is the Ace of Coins. You're talking to yourself, you just want a solid relationship, a commitment-based relationship, I feel like, you know, it's like emotions, you know, in, in whoever you're dealing with has gone haywire. That's why there's an apology. Let's see. You're a fat one, see? Gone haywire. Mm-hmm. The vampirella. Mm, this is snake bite. Okay. No, not the movie of, um, I forgot what movie it's like. Snakes and planes. Okay. That was a hit, I feel. It earned more than the end game. Snake, uh, snake and planes. Samuel L. Jackson, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, this is. Um, I feel like this is why you guys had. Uh, what, what? Why you guys want to um, address a situation? You want to make the relationship solid, because these words over here uh, coming out of this mouth. These are all hurtful words. When you guys fight, have you? Did, when did you ever feel good after a fight? Like, oh my God, we just had a wonderful fight. No, it doesn't work that way. Okay, and this is what this is what happened. That's why there's an apology with a page of coins. Mm hmm. Let me see here. Got four of coins. Okay. Um. You could be holding back right now. You you took that clutch, you know, you took that purse, you took that bag, and then you're holding on to yourself. It's just like I don't want to leave you and I don't want us to fight, but I'm not yet ready to talk. Because the four of coins here is like this strong. Mm -hmm. And four and five four and ace of coins, that's isolation. Isolation, give me some time. I need to think of it. I need to think of myself because this is the strength. You know, um, normally the four of coins is holding back, right? This is how we, we, we designed it. It's like when we were sketching it, it's just like what, what, what is something that hold, that you hold on to that is important? Normally it's your purse, ladies. Okay? The bros, you can hold the purse also. The purse of your ladies. Okay? <laughs> Guard it with your life while they're shopping, right? Got nine of coins. Okay. So the person okay, has an intention to make this statement because you have the nine of coins and then the ace of coins and the other one. So meaning they want to have a solid commitment, yes, um, but things has to be over first. I feel like what was supposed to be over is the argument. What was supposed to be over is like emotional breakdown. Okay, because look at this one. Slabels ring. Mm -hmm. The nine of coins here is showing a strong person who is ready, like the stand, like we stand, it's like a we stand, okay, someone here is saying it's like yes, I'm on board, whatever you say, okay, because a page of coins, the apology, five stories, like I, I, I'm, I'm dumb sometimes, you know, I do have, I, I lash out, this person is, and the other person is like, sometimes I'm an emotional wreck, okay, but both of you know that you guys want to be together, because the opportunity was ace of coins, okay, 
So, link down there, description box for everything that you need, okay? Um, this is gonna be for the Libra, so if you're new, it says extended reading, click that one. You have diamond, you have gold edition, and then next to this is stay tuned, um, it's gonna be the intro for the upcoming webinar. Okay, Libra, I'll see you guys again, bye. Hi everyone, I just wanna welcome you guys to my second webinar, which is for Jupiter. We are going to be exploring the planet of abundance, the planet that gives us our potential with regards to our growth in different ways in life that connects us to our luck. The planet that gives us a joy of fulfillment with regards to our karaka as a spouse in our chart or the masculine energy that we are looking for. On Jupiter Web Arnar, June 20th, join me at 11 a.m. The link below.